Hey everyone, no best, I'm Judy. Welcome to our reaction channel, and today we're reacting to the Honest Trailers Game of Thrones Volume 3. And before we begin, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share. And we have already seen the first two volumes, so go check those out. So let's just get into this. It was the highest rated show of its era, the most talked about pop culture event of the decade, and by the end of its final seasons, one of the biggest letdowns in its <laughs> history. Oh, have Bran the Broken, protector of the realm. Uh oh. Game of Thrones, <laughs> season six through eight. <laughs> The show, based on George R. R. Martin's doorstop novels, returns. But since they already burned through those, they're going off an outline. And boy, does it feel that hmm. way. We're after one mixed season that still pulled off some major highs. <laughs> the last two shortened ones scrambled to tie everything up real quick. <laughs> Because the showrunners either got bored, <laughs> burnt out, or bitter that no one liked their slavery idea. Oh. Featuring huge revelations that never really pay off. You're the true king. Yeah, so that's a good king point. It really pay off. You to the Night's Watch. Relationships that took years to develop, turning on a dime. Stay with me. <laughs> and characters who straight up forgot their best friends, Aww. or forgot they have magic shape shifting powers, or forgot who they're at war with. Danny kind of forgot about. The Iron Fleet. She forgot, forgot the biggest navy in Westeros existed? Admit it, this whole show was an elaborate plot for you to meet Ed Sheeran. <laughs> it's a pretty song. Winter has come to King's Landing, so they move the entire city to the desert? There, our main players will finally collide to see who will sit on the Iron Throne. Will the reign of Queen Cersei continue, or will she just stare out the window? Yeah, good point. She didn't have much to do last in the last season. <laughs> will Daenerys continue her surgical attacks against the ruling class? Or will she 420 blaze the world when her nephew won't give her the D no more? I didn't be feared. Oh my god. Will Jon Snow do anything? The <laughs> watch is ended. I'm tired oh, of fighting. I never wanted a crown. I don't want it. I never wanted it. <laughs> I told you I don't want it. I don't want it. <laughs> I never have. <laughs> no, the winner at the end of it all is the character with the best story. And who has a better story than Bran the Brute? <laughs> <laughs> Bran? <laughs> Bran? The creepy ass kid? How about like literally anyone else? <laughs> it's okay, epic voice guy. You remember, it's just a trailer. You gotta hype it up. You gotta sell the show. Sell the show. <laughs> Say goodbye to the complex heroes you've come to love, <laughs> and say hello to their one-dimensional lookalikes, like Varys, but of the dick joke. If I lost my c**k, I'd drink all the time. I don't think a c**k is a true qualification, as I'm sure you'd agree. You should consider yourself lucky. At least your balls won't freeze off. Because you have no c**k. Oh my god. Littlefinger, lord of that one balcony in Winterfell. <laughs> 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 oh my god, that's funny. Or the Arya Stark reunion tour. Lady Stark. You came home. You still have it. Needle. Hello, hot pot. I'm Arya. Lady Stark. Don't call me that. You said we'd meet again. And here we are. You left me to die. First I robbed you. While the show's reliably great villains backslide from the Joffrey S. Ramsay Bolton to the mysterious Night King, who after all your fan theories really was just some dude the uh, Keebler Elf stabbed to a tree. Right? To this soggy pickup artist who stole the dragon's plot armor for himself. I have to be honest, this is making me hot. Uh, what Tim Burton movie is this dork from? I'd take a dozen high sparrow lectures over more of the emo Pringles guy. <laughs> we are weak, vain creatures. Emo Pringles guy? We live only by the mother's mercy. Truly, everyone avails in for the war. I never the mother's Okay, never mind. But screw characters, because Game of Thrones can still deliver some amazing visual spectacles as soon as you remember how to crank the brightness on your TV. <laughs> there we go. From the claustrophobic terror of the Battle of the Bastards right? to the ground level chaos of the Battle of King's Landing to eight guys waiting for help on a frozen pod. <laughs> we have to burn his body. Oh, now you use the fire sword. Rest <laughs> assured that in the later seasons, everything will look awesome, and no one you really care about is gonna die. 
<laughs> yeah, they didn't really kill off too many main characters in the end. Not too many. They'll be fine. See? Good as new. <laughs> so lick your wounds for the show that managed to both limp and sprint to the finish line. <laughs> Just hold the door on giving it crap for not ending the way you thought. They can't please everybody. Or for characters teleporting around. They ought to converge at some point, or even all the huge strategic blunders. Mistakes aren't the same as potholes. No, be grateful for a show that's given us the last communal experience in our divided world. Crapping on the final seasons of Game of Thrones. <laughs> Together. Aw, gonna miss you, dumb show. Oh, go on, get out of here. Come on, I don't need you. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna watch the spinoffs. You crazy? <laughs> Starring Hack Sparrow. A Lannister always looks on the bright side. I think we might live. <laughs> I do. I'm here to help. Surely there's some good news lurking somewhere. <laughs> we should both be happy as well. Thank you. I feel much better. Mortal stick fight! <laughs> <laughs> Gosh. Yes, my queen. <laughs> I am loyal to my queen. I am loyal to my queen. <laughs> I obey my queen's commands. I kill the queen's enemies. The new prince of Dorn, I guess? <laughs> I don't know. Doesn't f***ing matter. <laughs> Snoke. No. Harry Strickland? What kind of name is Harry Strickland in a fantasy world? Harry Strickland sells propane and propane accessories. <laughs> All right, our next comedian. You might have seen him north of the wall. Give it up for Tommy <laughs> Giants Bay. Now, which one of you cowards <laughs> in my pants? <laughs> I saw your pecker. What kind of god would have a pecker that small? <laughs> you weigh as much as two fleas f***ing. <laughs> Stay back, he's got blue eyes! I've always had blue eyes! <laughs> <laughs> the laugh track. You're a lucky man. The <laughs> laugh track, honestly. <laughs> Fan service. Thought you might still be rowing. <laughs> Crap service. <gasps> <gasps> You're just gonna murder me? On this murder show? <laughs> <clears throat> Shippers. Hey, I don't get what's so funny about that. <laughs> good boy. Who's a good boy? We never forget you, my little pup. Less nudity than ever, but still. <laughs> Here we go again. <clears throat> Not as funny, you guys. This third time uh, around. No one wants to see that, or that, <laughs> and definitely not that. We've known her since she was 14, you sickos. Trying to impress, you're impossible to impress, Dad. I won't apologize for trying to rescue Theon. Then where is he? Your best hunters. They obviously had help. I didn't think Lady Sansa killed them all by herself. You managed to stay soft and fat, spending your life reading about the achievements of better men. Do we have the men? I don't have an army. Their army's gone. Our army's gone. Do we have enough men? How many men do we have in the north to fight in? 10,000 less? Fewer. We need every man we can get. We don't have the numbers. We don't have the numbers. We don't have the numbers. I don't have enough men. <laughs> we don't have the men. <laughs> you don't have the men. You said you don't have enough men. We need more men. We need oh more men. <laughs> we need more men. We're lucky to have this many men. It's not enough. No, it's not enough. Everything <laughs> characters have ever done wrong. I strangled my lover. I shot my own father with a crossbow. I betrayed my queen. I pushed a boy out of tower window. Crippled him for life. <laughs> I strangled my cousin with my own hands. We burned her at the stake. She was good, she was kind, and you killed her! I made a terrible mistake. I made a mistake. A horrible mistake. I underestimated a stranger. You don't know the things I've done. I did unspeakable things. I've done plenty of things that I regret. How compared to me, you haven't. And Kid Hairline. I mean, Harrington. <laughs> Damn, never gonna unsee that. <laughs> a slot of ice and fire. I don't care how many people Danny lights on fire. The hound will always have the sickest burns. <laughs> Getting old today. He's not. 
Thank you for watching this video. Yeah, the thing about well, honest trailers is like sometimes they have some really funny jokes. Right. And sometimes they drop the ball. Yeah. Sometimes I find like some of the jokes are hilarious and sometimes like the laugh track to Tormund, I thought was really cool. Right, 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 right. But then other times like the shippers, like it's just cringy. I don't know. I don't know anything. Like I get shippers, like I'm assuming it's ever seen how people ship like couples. Mm. But like I didn't really get what was so funny about all this. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. some of their, their jokes, I don't think, are as funny. So. But that is okay. I did not know. So. But now we've wrecked. Do you have anything else you want to add? And one more yawn for the night. <coughs> so don't forget to... Can I get those in? Yeah, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share if you like this uh, reaction. And, uh, yeah, have a beautiful and a Bye, everybody. Night.